Hey Simmers! Hi everyone! Welcome to Make 2 and an original house design in my town, Sims Landing. So I've previously done a let's build of this house, and as usual with my let's builds, I didn't show the decoration process, but I thought I would do a house tour so that you could see what the house looks like fully decorated. And so here it is, next to the real estate agency and the teen idol sign. So the occupants of this house, I don't know if we have any people on our channel who are into Avatar The Last Airbender or Legend of Korra, but the occupants of this house are Sokka, Zuko, and Aang. And so that kind of informed how I decorated the house. I wanted to go for a sort of Asian-inspired house very similar to the world of Avatar and Legend of Korra. Oh, so, there's a dragon. Yeah, this dragon is meant to be Momo. <laughs> Oh. Uh, yeah, because I needed a flying creature, and the dog running around here, that's meant to be Appa. So his name is uh, Appa Yip Yip, because that's what Aang cute. says. Yeah, to get him to fly. So... I thought that could be Zuko, Prince Zuko's dragon. It could be, but it's... Prince, too small. Yeah, too, well, too small, and also, we didn't really get to know Zuko's dragon that well, but we mm -hmm. know Momo very well. So, anyway... This house is on a standard lot, obviously, but it's two stories, and you enter through here, and this is where you get the staircase up to the upstairs, and there's also just a little bit of room for a Japanese countertop here to function as the coat closet for guests. So through the doorway that Momo just took, you enter the long combination living room and dining room. So. Again, I tried to go for Asian influences where, you know, I've got this Chinese couch next to Japanese bedside tables, but then also I thought keep a green theme and um, I had space for an extra set of couch and chairs, so I went for a green there. And then over here is a table for six. So there's only three guys in the house, but I've also got their friends, Katara and Toph, living in the Japanese resort, which we have done a video of on our channel as well, and I'll link you guys to that. And Katara and Toph, they live with Korra and Asami in that property. So this is the guy's house and that was the girl's house. <laughs> Through here is the kitchen, and it's just a really big kitchen. It's got a wraparound Japanese counter here. And we've got Aang and Sokka sitting down in the breakfast area. I think so, Aang looks really good. Yeah, I love that you can have, you know, bald sims. Um, this is the adult Aang, obviously, and he's... And the, hair, the facial hair as well. Yeah, yeah. I tried to <laughs> kind of match him to what we've seen in Legend of Korra, you know, for how Aang looks grown up. And this is Sokka. So I tried to go for, you know, his kind of crazy shaved head style and blue because he is water tribe, of course, and camouflage because they're, you know, very nature-y in the water tribe. Yeah. Yeah, so that's the downstairs area. Oh, and off the back of the dining area here, you can get into the yard, which has a pool decorated with Chinese lanterns from the Lunar New Year quest. Just a place to have a picnic, trees all around, and a gardening area. I love how open the whole of the first floor is. Yeah. It's mainly two big rooms, but it's because you've used all these large open doorways. Yes. The whole And you've used consistent colour scheme for the floor, the furnishings, and the walls, and yeah. windows, of course. Just really gives a yeah really good lightness to the whole place, a real sense of flow through the floor. Yeah, I definitely think if you have the same floor and walls throughout, yeah, as you said, it just kind of gives you that illusion yeah. of having a bigger space, even though it's split up into smaller yeah. rooms. It makes this bit feel more secluded and where you go to relax. Over here, a bit more relaxed and the rest of it. This is all, these two areas, three areas, mm -hmm. all feel like more busy flow space. So yeah, I think you get a bit of everything on this floor. I like it. Cool. Yeah, and just back here, as you said, a more secluded sitting room and office. And through here is just the bathroom for the downstairs. So, taking the stairs up, 
This is the bedroom area and there are three bedrooms here. And because I decorated this for these three guys, all of the bedrooms are the same size and all of the bathrooms are the same size and decorated very similarly. No so, favoritism. No favoritism, exactly. So, you know, even though Zuko is the Fire Lord, this is Zuko, by the way. Um, <laughs> even yeah, though... again, the hair is really good. <laughs> yeah. Even though it's not quite his hair, just to think, oh yeah. That's the kind of hair you'd have. <laughs> so even though Zuko is the Fire Lord, when he comes to hang out with Aang and Sokka in their house, you know, he lives just as they do. So actually, this is Sokka's room. And this is Sokka's room because it's kind of got more techy kind yeah. of stuff. And you know Sokka. He's, very, um, he's a very good inventor. He's very smart. So that's why this is his room. And yeah, so his bathroom is there. It's very similar, pretty much exactly, to this bathroom here, which I would say this is Zuko's room because it's a little bit darker. You know Zuko, he's got a lot of <laughs> angst. <laughs> so yeah, and he's got yeah, books and all of that. And then this room over here is Aang's, and it's sort of bluish because Aang is, you know, an airbender. Why is everybody going into not their rooms? I think it's hilarious how these sims just choose random chairs to go sit in. Yeah, they definitely like sitting down a lot. Yeah. But I think there's like, the program says, here are the 15 places you can sit. Mm -hmm. Pick it up between 1 and 15 and go and sit there. Yeah. 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 Maybe that's what goes on. Yeah. Maybe. And then so, another very similar, well, slightly different orient to the bathroom. Yeah, I mean, the bathrooms are the same size, but because of the way the house is laid out, they're positioned in different places. Mm -hmm. So yeah, sometimes the layout will be a little bit different. So yeah, that has been the Avatar The Last Airbender house. <laughs> Hopefully you guys enjoy the tour, whether you are fans of the shows or not. And please let us know in the comments what you think. And feel free to subscribe to our channel if you're new, because we've got plenty of Sims Free Play content as well. Thanks for watching.